Hello, I'm Fiona Walsh of Imagine Coaching and today we're going to look at merging shapes in PowerPoint. So I've inserted two shapes here, the rectangle and the circle, and I've given them uh, a white outline so we can see the difference there. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to highlight both of the shapes. So I'm going to press Control and click on both and the Drawing Tools Format tab will open. I click on that and over to the left hand side here we have Merge Shapes. So under the drop down we have a few different options. So the first one I'm going to pick is Union. And that basically puts the two shapes together and uh, turns that into one shape there. Okay. Move to the next slide and we'll go to the next example. So again I'm going to highlight both of my shapes. And under Merge Shapes now we have Combine. So when we click on Combine it will take out the uh, intersection and leave us with the remainder of the shape there. On to the next one. Highlight my shapes again. And this time we've got Fragment. So when I click on Fragment, it basically turns it into three different shapes. OK, so that's a very interesting one. Then the fourth example. is intersect. So when we click intersect, it just leaves the intersection. So the intersection is remaining. The next example is subtract. Now subtract works depending on which item is on top. So for this example, the circle is on top, so it removes the circle. And in the next example, I'll highlight both again. When we choose subtract, it subtracts the rectangle. So we have two different options there, depending which one is on top. So if you like that uh, tip and you'd like to see more, please connect with me on LinkedIn. Thank you. Bye.